Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 3459 in Candy Crush Saga, where we have 33 moves to collect four ingredients. One, two, three, four. They're all on the board. Here are the places to put them. Uh, and it looks like they won't get stuck anywhere. Sometimes that's a problem. But uh, even though we have these candy cane shelves here, we've got this on a conveyor belt. So we're going to have to somehow wend them down through onto this conveyor belt and then drop them through here. We've got some specials on the board to help us. We also have chocolate mixers right now. They can't damage us because, well, there's no place for them to grow. We've got this to help clear some of these things out once we can get to them. Um, because they'll explode with force. So we've got these guys on the conveyor belt already, but we've got a lot of problems in the way here. So look at these wrapped candies. They could be golden opportunities for us. Let's drop this down. The more quickly we can get rid of one ingredient at least, uh, the more quickly we don't have to deal with that ingredient because it becomes a blocker to us actually. It gets in our way. Let's take out that licorice. We've also got the licorice coming through here. So this, we can just draw this down directly. We don't even have to blow this up, but of course that would be more helpful. Mm, no good moves. I can do this, I can do this. That's about all I can see. I'm gonna choose this one. Try to get some of this purple together. There, now we're on that conveyor. I don't have too many choices. That looks like a good choice though, because I'd love to get that coconut wheel opened up. Uh, I can play around with the orange. I can play around with the red. The orange this way at least takes out a licorice and brings this down. Okay, so there we go with that. I got too excited and I didn't even look to see if there were any other opportunities there for me. I could do this and that would be nice and explosive and it would bring this down here and it would take out two layers of this. That looks good. I could just bring this down directly, but I like taking out the layers. Let's do this. Now I've also got these bobbers on the board. If I could maneuver things, I might be able to get some, um, yeah, you know, fish, fish on the board to help out. Oh, here's where the chocolate becomes a problem. Oh, look at that. I didn't even think about that happening. Okay, so I like where this is positioned. I don't know that I want to use it right away. This is a problem. I don't know how best to use this guy. He could hit the bobber and hit a fish. If I drop this down, this just covers over that wrapped candy. That doesn't help much. I'm going to play around a bit here. All right. Now what? I'm going to do this and bring this all the way through. Oh, stink, it didn't come all the way through. How did I not know that was going to happen? That seems like such a basic thing. All right, here's what I'm going to do. Bring that ingredient through, send this side off, and open things up. Knowing that I'm risking this, but also knowing I don't have a whole lot of green on the board, so it doesn't seem very valuable at this point in time. It would be better off just striking and taking out an individual color. Uh, at some point I've got to get to this. Now is I've got to get to both of those. And that's it's not set up to do that, but the the purple is coming around to match up, and I've got a lot more purple on the board. This purple is going to meet, but this is going to be gone. It's going to be a red instead. This green is going to come, and it's just going to shoot through here. So if I can kind of play it safe, I might be able to get some good things to happen. Okay, this looks good. These are going to take out this, not this. Oh well, I'm going to go for it anyway. And then the fish helped. Oh, or something helped. I don't know exactly what. But now we've got these floating down. So I'm not doing well, but I am learning so much on this board. 
very instructive as to how this thing operates and how intricately we have to deal with all of these little bits and pieces here. I still have to bring this down, but the chocolate can't grow there. The chocolate, however, is growing over this way. Not pleasant. I don't like that. Let's bring this through and then this downward. Okay. Take out a chocolate, concentrate things down. Oh well, we were able to collect two of the items, almost three. One, however, was really far away, but I understand everything better now. I understand uh, I have to be watching for when the chocolate is going to come out. And I understand now all the inter intricacies of dealing with those conveyor belts. Just because I understand it doesn't mean I'll be able to get it to work to my advantage. But if I don't understand it, then I have very, very little chance of success. So the more often I play win or lose, the better I'll get at this. I'll pause the recording, come back with a new board, and see if we can make a better attempt. This looks like a good way to start. A lot gets cleared out. A lot gets brought down. This is tempting, but I think it'll still be here in a bit. I want to go for getting these guys cleared out. When I say it'll be here, I think it'll come back around. But of course, it won't be here because the conveyor belt takes things away. All right, let's remove those. And now it's back. Do I want it? I think I kind of want to do this. This hits a lot, including these and including this, which could do some nice damage. Although, I mean, it's not really the best time to do that, but I don't know. Well, this came back around. This is less likely to because it's up higher. I'm going to go for this. I'm going to go for maximum volume of damage. Now, we've got a lot of ingredients kind of converging in one spot. <laughs> no choices here. I can do this move or I can just quit. I guess that's my choice. There we go, reshuffle. I can make a stripe that heads down this way. I could take out a licorice, which brings this down further. I'm going to go for this choice. And now what? I could do this, which strikes through here. Not quite what I wanted to do though, right? Let's go this route. Oh, this just got interesting. If I do this, this gets hit, this comes down this way and takes out both layers of this, and it takes out this. It leaves this behind, which I'm not sure I want to do. So even though it's kind of big and disruptive, I think I would prefer doing this. I've got these guys I can't bring down yet. Unless I use this right away, why wouldn't I? Let's do it. There we go. Brought both of those down. And we're clearing this out a bit, so we'll allow things to slide. Um, I could do this. Not my favorite. Not with this on the ledge. Let's take an option there. And now I think maybe... This would be good. Not as good as I thought. Wow. I, I should have looked at that closer since I already... Uh, since so much on the board had changed and I, I didn't really evaluate what would happen. Okay, I don't like any of my moves. I think I'm going to work up here and try to get specials here that I can bring downward. So we've got blue on this conveyor belt now. We can try to make something happen there. Yikes with this. There we go. So there's that blue. And there's a purple, and it's coming around this way. Can't quite use it. Can't set that off. Now I'm going to take out blue because I expended a lot of blue, so now I'm taking out the colors. Here we go. There's that opportunity. We're sending out fish. So we've got all of the ingredients in this area. Here we go. This is close to getting dropped off. I can't bring that down, so let's do this. 
now I want to do something to bring that through. Maybe there'll be a green on top. There was not. I could do this now. It doesn't really help over here, but I can't do anything better at this point. So let's get that out of the way. Now we've got more things available. I've got this. I want to hold on to it, but the chocolate is going to grow. So let's just keep clearing this out and seeing if that'll allow us to capture this better. Yep, it did. Look at that poor guy stuck right there. Cannot get... Oh, hold on. Purple's coming around. Purple's leaving. Purple's coming around. Purple's leaving. Let's try to get more purple there. Arr, this is good. This is good. Okay. <sighs> I'm just going to take out all blue. It's going to bring this down and concentrate the colors. Now I've got this opportunity. Remember that I can try to get the, the fish bobbers as well. This needs a moment to come around, but when that happens, this won't be lined up still. So I'm going to take the opportunity to do this. Now, I need to bring this down. It's the striped wrapped over here that's going to help with that. There we go. Okay, so that's how I beat that level. That was my fourth playthrough for recording purposes. Kind of surprised I got it done that quickly because it is a circuitous path to bring these around all of those corners. But if you know how it works and you stick with it, you'll get it done. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.